Here's the calculations for the equivalent resistance of two series parallel circuits. Note here that we've got a voltage that appears across each resistance. Call that V1 and V2. Notice how the terminal labels, the plus and the minus, are exactly the same wire, or officially would say the same node. They share the same voltage, therefore these two resistors are in parallel. Symbolically, you use the same parallel symbol from geometry. We write that as R1 in parallel with R4. Now we would calculate that equivalent resistance as the sum of the reciprocal of the resistances and then the reciprocal of that sum. In a similar way, we have R2 in parallel with R5 and R3 in parallel with R6. Now at this point, we observe that the current I entering the left side of the chain of resistors here passes through each one of these resistors. Since all of these resistors share the same current, they are in series. We then write that the equivalent resistance between terminals A and B is the sum of those parallel resistor combinations. So expanding the geometry symbol for parallel resistors gives us this expression for the equivalent resistance. Alright, let's move on to the second circuit. We're looking for the equivalent resistance between C and D. We see R2 and R3 share the same current. They are in series, so replace that with just a single resistance, which is R2 plus R3. We also see that all four of these resistors share the same current as well. They are in series. Now if we think about current entering terminal C, we see that it splits one into one path I1 and another path I2. Eventually they rejoin to make the current I flowing out of terminal D. So you see two parallel conducting paths. Or another way to see this is that we have only one voltage that appears across the, the top path and the bottom path. So we would say that these two sets of resistors are in parallel. In this case, the equivalent resistance is 1 over R2 plus R3. That forms the conductance. Then we would have 1 over that sum, add those together, and take the reciprocal. 